Personality disorders are a group of mental health conditions characterized by enduring patterns of behavior, cognition, and inner experience that deviate markedly from the expectations of the individual's culture. These patterns cause significant distress or impairment in social, occupational, and other important areas of functioning. In this video, we will explore the types, causes, and treatment of personality disorders. Types of personality disorders There are several recognized types of personality disorders, which are categorized into three clusters. Cluster A. Odd, eccentric behavior. Paranoid personality disorder. Individuals with this disorder are excessively distrustful and suspicious of others, often interpreting benign actions as malevolent. Schizoid personality disorder. People with schizoid personality disorder tend to be emotionally detached and have a limited range of emotional expression. They prefer solitary activities and have little interest in social relationships. Schizotypal personality disorder. This disorder is characterized by odd beliefs, magical thinking, unusual perceptual experiences, and social and interpersonal deficits. Cluster B. Dramatic, emotional, or erratic behavior. Antisocial personality disorder. People with antisocial personality disorder display a pattern of disregard for the rights of others, often engaging in criminal behavior, deceit, and impulsivity. Borderline personality disorder. Individuals with borderline personality disorder often experience intense mood swings, have unstable relationships, and struggle with self-image. They may engage in self-destructive behaviors. Histrionic personality disorder. Histrionic individuals are often attention-seeking, emotionally shallow, and uncomfortable when not the center of attention. Narcissistic personality disorder. People with narcissistic personality disorder have an exaggerated sense of self-importance, require excessive admiration, and lack empathy for others. Cluster C. Anxious, fearful behavior. Avoidant personality disorder. Individuals with avoidant personality disorder are extremely sensitive to rejection and avoid social interactions due to their fear of criticism or disapproval. Dependent personality disorder. People with dependent personality disorder have an excessive need to be taken care of and fear separation from loved ones. Obsessive compulsive personality disorder. This disorder is characterized by an obsession with order, control, and perfectionism, which can impair an individual's flexibility and openness. Causes of personality disorders. The exact causes of personality disorders are not fully understood but they are believed to result from a combination of genetic, environmental, and psychological factors. Some potential factors include Genetics Research suggests that there may be a genetic predisposition to personality disorders. Family history can play a role in their development. Environmental factors Early life experiences, such as childhood trauma, abuse, or neglect, can increase the risk of developing a personality disorder. Neurobiological factors. Differences in brain structure and function may contribute to the development of certain personality disorders. Psychological factors. Maladaptive personality traits or coping mechanisms may evolve into more pronounced and dysfunctional patterns over time. Treatment of personality disorders. Treatment for personality disorders often involves a combination of psychotherapy, medication, and support. Here are some common approaches. Psychotherapy. Different types of therapy, such as dialectical behavior therapy, DBT, cognitive behavioral therapy, CBT, and psychodynamic therapy, are used to address specific symptoms and help individuals develop healthier coping mechanisms. Medication. While medication does not treat the personality disorder itself, it can help manage certain symptoms, such as mood swings or impulsivity. Hospitalization. In severe cases or during crisis situations, hospitalization may be necessary to ensure the safety of the individual and those around them. Supportive services. Building a support network, including friends, family, and support groups, can be crucial for individuals with personality disorders. Conclusion. Personality disorders are complex and often challenging to treat. 
but with the right therapeutic interventions and support, individuals can improve their quality of life and functioning. Early diagnosis and intervention are essential in managing these conditions and preventing long-term consequences. If you or someone you know is struggling with a personality disorder, seeking professional help is a critical step toward a better and more fulfilling life.